Medicinal Mushrooms in Autoimmune Disease Management. Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. You know, there's some evidence that medicinal mushrooms can help in the long-term management of certain autoimmune diseases. Medicinal mushrooms act as immunoregulators or immune system regulators, which means they can calm an overactive immune system. So if the immune system is overactive as it is in, immune, in autoimmune diseases, it can help to create a healthier balance to how the immune system is, is working. So the active ingredients in medicinal mushrooms, primarily the beta-glucans, polysaccharides, they act as biologic response modifiers. What does that mean? It means if the immune system is too weak, as occurs in cancer or chronic mononucleosis, it can boost the immune system function to get it to work more efficiently. It also means this, if the immune system is overactive as it is in autoimmune diseases, it can calm it down and regulate it and get it to act more appropriately. So this is what a biologic response modifier can do. So in autoimmune disease, what's happening is that part of it is that the, the certain immune cells called the T1 helper cells are secreting too many inflammatory chemicals and getting the whole immune system uh, you know, uh, overactive and attacking healthy tissue. So what medicinal mushrooms can do is to tone down the T1 helper cells to decrease the overall inflammatory response and boost the T2 helper cells, which have an anti-inflammatory calming effect. So it, now in cancer, it's the opposite. What's happening in cancer is that the T1 uh, activity is too low, and so the immune system is not stimulated enough to help the other immune cells attack cancer cells. So biologic response modifiers in that situation can boost the T1 activity and get the immune cells into the fight. So biologic response modifiers get the immune system to act in the most appropriate way based upon the circumstances. There are a number of biologic response modifiers that you can take as supplements. Vitamin D works this way. Probiotics, friendly bacteria, work this way. Melatonin works this way to some degree. Some plant phytosterols work this way. But I will tell you that medicinal mushrooms and astragalus have a very profound effect on immune system regulation and so they should be included. I usually tell patients to take a supplement combination that has reishi mushroom extract with astragalus and then two detoxifying agents, indole 3-carbonyl and milk thistle, so all in one supplement. They may have to take four to six capsules a day in autoimmune disease to really get the meaningful therapeutic effect. But that combination of reishi mushroom, astragalus, indole 3-carbonyl and milk thistle, I really like it. In addition to that, I usually add a thing called the 14 mushroom blend, which is a powdered mixture and you would take two teaspoons, which would be four grams, and you would, you would mix it into some low-fat yogurt or into some applesauce, sprinkle it onto some cereal. There's different ways of having it that would get enough of those beta-glucans into your body to get this significant immune modulation effect. Anyway, to understand this in more detail, click on the link below, read my article. It's called Nutrition and Supplementation Management in Autoimmune Disease. It's a comprehensive plan, but because you need more than just medicinal mushrooms to really get the effects we're talking about. You'll see that the article has all the scientific references, so you'll know you're getting only sound scientific information from me on this subject. It's important because most medical doctors don't understand the nutrition and natural medicine component of managing this, these diseases. It's not their fault. It's just never shown to them in medical school or in continuing education courses, but the evidence is there. So most medical doctors prescribe drugs to suppress the immune system, decrease inflammation, corticosteroid drugs. But you know, if you, take, if you rely heavily on those drugs, it increases your risk of cancer and infection and cataracts, osteoporosis, gastrointestinal bleeding, liver damage, kidney damage, kidney failure. So you want to try to minimize the reliance that you have to have on those drugs as best you can. That's where diet and lifestyle and supplementation comes into play. So click on the link below, read the article, and get the details of what the nutrition and lifestyle plan should look like. Now at machinohealth.com, you'll see my other research review papers. You'll see footage from my live professional seminars, other videos, resources, downloads I've created. They're all there for free to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. All my review articles and teaching materials are complete with all the scientific references, so you'll know you're getting only sound scientific information from me on any health topic that you're looking for. So make sure that you use machinohealth.com as an ongoing, reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family members. Thanks so much for watching.